What's up, everybody? It's Alex from ELM here, and I'm going to show you how to scale your landscaping business to the moon. Stay tuned. Now, in this training today, we're going to talk about numbers. And once you understand your marketing budget and how much it's costing you to get customers, you're going to be able to spend more money into marketing, more money into advertising, and be able to get an actual return once you start understanding the numbers. Now, the reason I'm creating this video is because I've spoken to multiple, multiple business owners in the landscaping industry who just don't understand how much money they're putting into marketing and how much money they're getting back. Once you understand this concept, you'll know that this is the best way to grow your landscaping business without going out there to do door hangers, flyers, um, and other laborious task. So let's just start out with CPA, right? CPA, this is cost per acquisition. How much does it cost you to acquire a new customer? You want to know your CPA. Now your CPA is going to be subtracted out of the cost of the job. So whatever you price that job is. So let's say it's a $500 mulch job that you got and the cost per acquisition was you know maybe it was a hundred bucks right who knows so the hundred dollars minus your 500 this was done the wrong way but so now you're working at four hundred dollars you got to take out you know all of your expenses after that but but do you see do you see how if it cost you a hundred dollars if you put in another hundred dollars, you're going to be able to get another job. So such as Facebook ads, Facebook, PPC, right? PPC ads, your SEO, right? This, these are all marketing strategies for you. And you can even do flyers as long as you're uh, keeping track of your numbers. These all have CPAs, right? These all have CPAs. Okay. Now, it's your job to understand the, the CPA or it's your job to hire somebody like us to figure out the CPA for you and to give you actual results um, uh, month after month so you can see that your marketing is actually giving you a return on your investment. If you're just spending money aimlessly, it doesn't make sense. So for Facebook, your cost per acquisition for uh, different types of jobs depend on the market you're in. Same with PPC, same with SEO, and same with flyers. Now, the thing I've noticed with the landscaping industry, because I've been in e-commerce, I've been in garbage can cleaning, I've run Facebook ads and Google ads on multiple uh, in multiple industries, and it depends on the marketplace and it depends on the competition that you're going to be um, uh, playing against. And all of these platforms, Facebook and Google, they want to give their end user the best experience. So by you per having an awesome ad, such as a testimonial, such as a before and after, such as having a funny, humorous comedy text in your creative, then you're going to have a lower cost per acquisition because these platforms are going to reward you with having the most, the highest intent customers in front of your ads. So what do I mean by that? Let me uh, take all this stuff out of here. Um, I don't know. Can I just delete this? Let me move this. <laughs> all right, there, it's gone. Okay, so what I mean by that is by your, let's say this is a Facebook ad, right? There's text up here. There's a before and after right here, before after photo and it's awesome quality and people are getting a bunch of engagement let's say this is the engagement this is a heart right here and there's 55 likes okay this ad is performing well then the cpa cost per acquisition will be lower because it's an awesome ad now let's say let's say this the ad sucks you know right it's a text right here, boring text, 
say the video it's it's just a picture of you know a flower i don't know mulch and there's no engagement then your cpa will be much more expensive much more expensive because they don't want to show your ad to that the, the best uh candidates right so by understanding your cpa you can infinitely scale your business let's say you're getting consistent customers for $75 and your average job cost your average job price is $500 it's like a vending machine i don't know how to make a vending machine it's like a vending machine right and in the vending machine there's a bunch of customers right and on the side it has the price right $75 and then there's the little slot and all you need to do is just keep putting more money into this vending machine and more customers are going to pop out right that's what happens more customers are going to pop out of this vending machine like clockwork and now you have a customer acquisition funnel okay now that's it for this video so you understand the cost per acquisition this is how you can infinitely scale your business now you need to have a back-end solution to where to send these people you need to have email marketing set up you need to have reputation management set up you need to have all of this set up so you're not wasting your marketing dollars i'll see you in the next video thanks a lot